Today is the day. We are moving into Flamingo Crossings today. I've been staying in Saratoga Springs with my family, so I haven't done any vlogging in Florida yet because I'm just wanting to enjoy with my family before I actually move in. But today is September 3rd, which means we are moving in today. We're gonna meet my roommate. We're gonna do all of the moving in things. I know it's like really yellow in here, but that's because it is currently 8 a.m. and I have to be at Flamingo Crossings at 8.35. So we are just getting all of my things packed. My parents, well, my mom and my boyfriend just took all of my suitcases out to the car so that I could finish getting ready. Let's do this thing! So, we are all checked in. Background check is done, which is great. So now I'm going to find my family and go to my apartment and check it out i'm so excited i did see my roommate although she didn't see me so that's a little awkward but it should be a lot of fun so we're going to go check out the apartment right now hello you guys in a strange turn of events Somehow, some way, my camera for the entire day today has been filming in slow motion. I went to the community center, which is why I'm out and about at Flamingo Crossings, to do some editing on a video and I uh, went through all of my footage. Everything, absolutely everything, is in slow motion with no sound. So, uh, love that for me. But I tried to film me doing all my decorations in my room. I tried to film a little bit of just like going into the community center and doing some editing. None of it. None of it works. So um, I'm gonna have to give you guys the Spark Notes version when we get home. I'm gonna show you guys the finished apartment because all of the other footage is obviously not usable because I was talking and there was no sound and it was in slow motion. It was just, I don't know how that happened. I'm gonna have to figure that out. It's a new camera, relatively new to me. So, oh well. But yesterday was the actual move-in day. So I know that that day was a little bit hectic, but it was with my family. I was trying to savor the last little bit of it. So we're obviously in a different outfit in this video. I think I'm going to actually extend this to tomorrow too and just make traditions its own video. So that's something to look forward to. Um, excuse me? <laughs> I need to get in, sir. You can see my room a little bit right now, but I'm going to give you guys a little bit of an overview now that it's done, even though I couldn't even... It makes me so upset. I had so much footage and now it's just unusable because I talked the whole time and there was no sound. I'm using a little bit of the montage footage in this video because there needs to be no sound for those, but uh, all the talking videos are just like gone. So take two. Okay, so first up we have my door here. I'm actually gonna turn the light on so you can see everything a little bit better. My door here has a little hanger on it, just like came built in. This is holding my knee brace right now, but I'm just having it hold all of my bags and my two hats. So I have my two lounge flies, my Kavu bag that I'm probably gonna use for like going to places that aren't Disney. <laughs> and then, yeah, the two bags are gonna be my park bags, my two hats. That's just kind of what my door looks like. I also added this little key ring here. So it's gonna hold my wallet and stuff. This is my college wallet. It works great. I got a lanyard. I'm in doc, by the way, but I got a lanyard for my pass, my like Flamingo Crossings card. And I have this instead. And this is a little bit more more, I don't know, compact and I like this more. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. It's just really cute. Also, this is really, really good quality. It feels like a regular like Disney pin. So love that. I also got this little pin yesterday, which is really cute. So that's just kind of sitting here. Next up, the infamous ear wall. So I have eight pairs total here. I feel like I'm probably gonna end up getting a little bit more just because obviously it is Disney, you're gonna wanna get a couple more pairs of ears, you know? These I actually made myself, so all of these are made by me, which is really great. Also this pair, I know it looks like it has two bows, but it actually has a Velcro on it, which is really cool. So I can kind of interchange these two bows, but this is what the ear wall looks like. Pretty simple, pretty easy. I have two more of the ear hanger thingies that are command strips, so I'll probably be getting at least two more ears, you know, so. 
Anyways, that's what the ear wall looks like. This is my closet, obviously. I love the fact that this has a floor length mirror. The closet is pretty minimal right now. So all of my hanging clothes are just like on this side. Over here, I have a bunch of randomness. The actual apartment here, my roommate has an ADA accommodation. So that means that basically everything has to be accessible without having to move too much. So because of that, a lot of the kitchen is like, very minimal storage for four people just because a couple of the cabinets have been taken out so that a wheelchair can get underneath them. She doesn't have a wheelchair, but that's just kind of how it ended up. So because of that, there's not a whole lot of storage in the kitchen. So I have over on this side of my closet, like a little storage area for all of my backups. So like if I got two of something, I put them up there and I just don't really have space right now. So a lot of my stuff is up there, which is totally fine. I have the room for it. So it is what it is. I have my shoes down in this corner. That's a bag of bags for like trash bags and stuff. My laundry hamper, my rain jacket, a lot of randomness. That's my lunchbox for work. So that's what the closet looks like. Pretty self-explanatory and simple. I have my backpack here that's just probably gonna live here. I have this little guy. This is actually a stained glass puzzle that I made. It's really, really cute, really sturdy too. So I just like that it's kind of sitting there. Windowsill for charging random things. <laughs> this is a rolling nightstand, so it can turn into a desk. It can go up and down. It's pretty, pretty cool, but this is kind of what it looks like right now. I know it looks like a lot of cords, but I don't really care to be honest. Like as long as it's charging something, that's what matters. So this is what my nightstand setup looks like. Obviously the bed, if you've seen any of my college vlogs, this it looks probably very familiar to you, but I got this bed set on Target, I think. So this is going to be its last home before I give it away. This is not coming back to me to North Carolina. It's going to stay in Florida or go wherever the next person wants it. But once I'm done with the program, this set is going to be not mine anymore. I also have my string stars here. This actually came with clips to put like pictures on it, but I ended up just not wanting to do that. So the stars are really cute, really simple. Also all around the room are these fairy lights that my boyfriend actually set up for me while I was at a orientation type thing for Flamingo Crossings yesterday. Come on, focus. <laughs> Oh, there we go. So he surprised me by getting that all set up for me, which is really sweet of him. Over here is the gallery wall. So I made the majority of these photos, except for the Mickey Mouse blueprint looking thing and this little ornament here. The rest of these I made myself. So I like the little gallery wall. It's really cute. That ornament right there is for my boyfriend. And then this was a birthday present from my best friend Kendall. So shout out to her. She has a little presence here. Over here, every Flamingo Crossings room comes with two locked drawers. Mine and I have a lock on over here just because I have like extra cash and my like checkbook and stuff in there that doesn't really need to be out and about. I just have it in there all in one place that everything is kind of locked away. And then in here I have like my extra set of sheets and other random stuff. But over here is my favorite part of the place. So I'll run you through the rest of this. This is pretty much like my getting ready station. So I have my glasses and sunglasses here. This box, this is actually a lid to this box over here. My best friend Kendall gave me a care package that I did open up while I I was filming with my camera on slow motion, so I didn't get any of that raw footage, which is really unfortunate, but she was super sweet and gave me a huge care package, so love her so much. But this little stitchy guy came inside it, so he's just kind of sitting here. I also have gum. This is going to be like, for work and for just like sitting around at home. I don't bring this into the parks just because I don't like being that person with gum in the parks because gum is actually not allowed or permitted to be sold in the parks. So if it's not sold, I try not to bring it. So this is just kind of kind of sit here for when I'm at home. Random claw clip, I don't really know why. This is my jewelry. So these are actually, if you've seen my packing vlogs, you know this, but these are little inserts to a necklace that I have. So I didn't have to bring quite as many jewelry pieces, which is really nice. I can just like insert different pieces to go with different outfits. And then in here, if I can open it, come on. This is all of my jewelry. So I have a couple of necklaces here and then bobble bar earrings and a bunch of other random jewelry in here. So this is where all of my jewelry is sitting. I'm okay with just having this jewelry. I wear this every day almost, so I don't really need much more than this. This is like my everyday makeup kit. So I have other pieces of makeup kind of in this bottom drawer, things that are like glitters and stuff for like parties or something like that. But this is going to be like my everyday work makeup bag. I'm not gonna be wearing a whole lot of makeup anyway. This is just a couple of products that I like to use on the regular. I also obviously have sunscreen, deodorant, perfume, 
the works, the usual. And then I repurposed the box that my friend gave me and put all of my cute little Disney trinkets in here. So this is a Polaroid printer. This was my Polaroid camera and my little Polaroid photo album. I would love to fill this up while I'm here. I also have this little press penny collection kit thing it's empty right now so i'd love to fill that up as well this has some like disney pins in it that i would love to trade this is just an extra little luggage tag my best friend kendall who's going to visit me in a couple of weeks wants me to give her this because i have a double so he's just going to be sitting here until she comes to visit and then in here are a couple other like little necklace pendants that i can change out and stuff so that's what it looks like also tripod obviously. So that's pretty much the entire room. This is where all of the lights are coming up from and then they wrap around like this. So I think that my room is pretty darn cool. I love it so much. So I'm excited to live here for the next five months. So I don't really know what I'm going to do now that I'm like all moved in and stuff. I might do some editing on a video because the SD card that I had all of my footage on is actually not in this camera, it's in another camera. So hopefully I can find it somewhere. <laughs> I think I brought it with me. If I didn't, then oh well, we're just going to have one packing vlog. But if you see two packing vlogs on my channel, I found the footage. So that's pretty cool. But I think I'm going to just edit that video for a little while. And then we'll just kind of have a cozy night in because it does kind of look like it's going to rain. So this is so unfortunate. The chain of my like camera holder came off. So that's really sad. I hope I can fix it or find something to fix it. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Day, this Thursday which means that tomorrow I have traditions so today as you can see I am wearing a park outfit because we're going to be going to Hollywood Studios I'm gonna be doing a little bit of like a mock commute type thing just to kind of see how long it's gonna take for me to get from my apartment to the bus stop to Hollywood Studios just to you know make sure that I kind of know where I'm going so with that we're gonna head down to Hollywood Studios today we're gonna to do a couple of things just kind of wander around I don't have Genie Plus or anything today we're just kind of kind of wing it and see what happens but here's my little outfit of the day i'm gonna go ahead and tell you right now i don't know where any of this outfit stuff is from but i have this little athletic t-shirt as well as some white jean shorts and my black hokas these ears i made myself they have the little like sidekicks on them so i'm also going to be wearing my sidekicks lounge fly so this is going to be kind of the outfit for today i do see myself getting a couple things today like merchandise wise but other than that i don't really know what else is going to happen so I would like to maybe try and see Fantasmic as well. We're just gonna have to, you know, see what the day holds for me, but this is the outfit. So let's head to Hollywood Studios. Okay, so we have made it. I know you can't really see me, but I don't have my tripod with me. I should have brought it, but I have my rain jacket and priorities are key. But I'm gonna check the wait times real fast and see what we want to do first. We could do Muppet Vision, that's like 10 minutes. Ooh, Star Tours is also 10 minutes. Maybe we'll do Star Tours first and then do Muppet Vision and then go from there. I just realized I left my Disney College program button in my room. Oh well. Okay, so Mickey and Minnie's actually is now at a 15 minute wait. It was just under like temporary closure. So I'm gonna try and walk on to Mickey and Minnie's. This is going to be my home ride, by the way, if I haven't said that. We've had a little bit of a change of plans as to what my role is. And I'll tell you about that a little later, but I'm now working Runaway Railway. So let's go see if we can ride it.
cannot believe that this is my like home ride. Insane. So let's go look at some wait times and see what we want to do next. So now we're going to go to Muppet Vision, the original plan. It is air conditioned and it's only 10 minutes. I think now we're going to go and get myself a Disney churro. I've never had a churro before and I saw someone while I was like taking a break and people watching that they had a churro and it looked really yummy. So let's go get one. You guys look at this. I'm totally taking a picture of this and remembering this for when I have my discount because oh my god. It is next to the Disney Sea kiosk here in Hollywood Studios. I went across the street and found these in the jewelry section. Those would be perfect for Runaway Railway. Oh my god. These ears. I have so many good outfits that could go with those. Oh my gosh. Okay, this angle is terrible, but we got the churro. I'm just gonna try it on its own first. Mm. Yeah, that's yummy. I'm gonna try it with the chocolate sauce. It comes with it's hot. Oh, I should have gotten a napkin, but oh well. Mm. Yum. Okay, game plan from here. I think I'm gonna do some shopping. Hopefully not spend too much money. And then I'll either go to a resort or go back to the room, my room, and we'll come back for Fantasmic. Fingers crossed. So I didn't actually spend any money in there. I did not notice just how much a little plushie costed. I thought it was gonna be like $10, no, it was $20. So we are waiting to buy stuff until I get my cast member like discount thing. So with that said, I think I'm gonna go take a Skyliner run and go to the Riviera for a little while. One of my favorite hotels. So we're gonna head down there and just kind of have a cute time because it does look like it is about to rain. So we're just kind of just kind of wandering and we'll see what we get up to. But we're definitely going to the Riviera. We are on the Skyliner and there she goes. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sure you hear a lot of this. Is that it? Okay, cool. We hope you enjoyed your visit to Hollywood today. I'm sorry if it's a little windy, but today's been so fun. Like imagine just being able to come to the park whenever you want. Now granted, I don't have my main gate right now. This is like a reservation, like a complimentary reservation, but it's so crazy that I can just like come to Hollywood Studios on a random day. That's wild. As for the rest of the day, I know I want to go to, like I said, the Riviera. We're gonna have to get off at the next stop to take a detour, take a connection, if you will. I don't know if I'm gonna explore Caribbean Beach or not. I've not actually been to this one, so maybe we'll get off here and just kind of wander. I don't know what I'm going to do from here. I, like I said, I would like to see Fantasmic if I can, but I might just be too tired. I have traditions tomorrow, so that's going to be a different vlog. Yeah, I don't really know what I'm going to do from here on out. I might go back to the room a little early. I don't, I'm going to have to check the weather because I don't want to be stuck out here in the rain. I know that's kind of Florida, but I don't like the rain. And I brought my rain jacket just in case, but if I can avoid it, then I will. <laughs> so I'll just have to check that and see. Did you know? to the Riviera. You can see the Skyliner in the background. That's so cool. I think what's gonna happen is I'm not gonna be seeing Fantasmic tonight because it looks like it is going to rain a lot tonight. So with that, this is going to kind of be like the end of this extravaganza. I'll go back to Hollywood to get the bus back because I don't know where the bus for the Riviera stop is and I don't know if it's backstage. And because I don't have clearance, we're just gonna have to go back to the Hollywood stop. But I figured I would just take a wander, chill over here for a minute, and then we'll go back to Hollywood to take the bus back to Flamingo. <laughs> And you probably can't hear me very well, but the boys are here. Goofy, Donald, and Pluto just came to say hi. I got a picture with Goofy. I'll pop a picture up if it looks cute. I love characters. I love this place so much. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go back to Hollywood now. I'm kind of done with being out and about. So let's head home. So <laughs> I'm instead walking because they're doing maintenance on the like Epcot station of the Skyliner. So I'm walking to the Caribbean beach like hub area so that I can get on the Skyliner hopefully before it rains. This might be an adventure. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, it's raining now. I'm glad I chose to just go home because wow, 
and there's worse heading our way. I saw it on the Skyliner. It looks like a wall of rain. Yay. My hair is a frizzy mess from that rain, but I just talked with one of my new roommates for a little while and she seems really cool. She's from Puerto Rico, so that's really fun and exciting. She works in Magic Kingdom, so we talked about that for a little bit. And then I just kind of have been chilling in here. I talked to my boyfriend for a little while and it is currently 8.30. Tomorrow is Traditions Day, so it's going to be its own little video and I hope you guys stick around for that. But it's been a really fun little move-in week. I've enjoyed it a lot. I'm learning new things, meeting new people. I met a couple new friends on the bus on the way home today. So that was really fun. You might see them. I don't know if they're gonna be okay with being on the vlog or not, but I hope that I get to see them again. They're gonna be at my traditions tomorrow. So maybe you'll see them, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little move-in video. I think it was a lot of fun. If you did, please leave a like. I would really appreciate it and subscribe for more Disney College program content to come. Like I said, the next video is going to be my traditions vlog. So stay tuned for that. In the meantime, I will see you in my next video. Bye.